Dr. Manveer Bhatia, a senior neurologist and a sleep specialist at the Neurology and Sleep Center, New Delhi. To continue with our series on what can one do to get a good night's sleep. And we were discussing that identify the issue or the concern and then uh, improve it further. So first, we talked about caffeine. In this, I'm going to be talking about the thoughts. So a lot of patients come forward with this complaint that they cannot shut their mind. Uh, the brain goes on thinking and thinking and thinking. It's as if it's, we call this a racing mind, that you're not able to shut the thoughts. And this can, yes, uh, be very disturbing and cause difficulty in falling asleep. So what can one do? Just a few simple things. First and foremost is to have a closure at the end of the day. That means between you shut the work, put off the devices, shut off the screens at least 30 to 40 minutes before uh, getting ready for bed. So in that 30 to 40 minutes, the brain needs to do what is called as an unwinding, slowing down or something which is calming. Second thing one which, which one can do is to make a note of the things at a pre-designated time. So you can call it a scheduling time, a worry time, a planning time. Any